Hey everyone, Jack here. Uh, welcome back to another match day experience. I hope you're all doing well. You joined me this morning from the stunning um, Surrey doing a park. Well, I'm not doing a park run. Jen's doing a park run this morning over there somewhere. So I've uh, dropped her off and I'm going to go watch uh, the keen runners this morning. Well done to them all. What a beautiful morning it is. It's the day of Manchester City today at Carrow. It's the late kickoff, so we haven't got to leave here too early, which is nice. Um, <laughs> I'd be lying if I said I was not nervous. Uh, I was nervous before I heard the injury news yesterday. And then I heard basically nine of our 11 starting 11 are out injured, which isn't ideal. Um, but there we go. So yeah, I'm looking forward to getting back to Norwich though. I'm looking forward to it. I haven't been back for a few weeks now. And um, you kind of fall, fall out of the loop a bit with, with what's going on with Norwich. You're in such a bubble, aren't you? in when you're in Norfolk because everyone supports Norwich and now you kind of you move elsewhere or whatever and um not everyone does which is a shame but I'm looking forward to seeing Chris I'm looking forward to seeing everyone else um looking forward to scratching a few golden goal tickets and seeing if we can win there and uh, just see what goes on really I've got limited expect well no expectation in fact um but yeah it's gonna be nice to get back to Cairo so follow me around let's see what we get up to and hopefully It'll be a good day. So you know what I was saying about them injuries? Um, let me show you who's injured. So, let's go to Michael Bailey on Twitter because he's put it out on a nice list. Thanks, Michael, for bringing us good news. So Tim Close out all season. Christoph Zimmerman out until January. Hernandez from falling down the stairs out till November. Aaron's is out till mid-October from international duty. Thomas Tribal is out till mid-October. Morris Leitner hasn't trained in two weeks. Mary Vrancic, short term. Roberts, ineligible. Hanley, groin. Godfrey, international injury. Cruel, training injury. Now, I don't want to get too over the top here, but that is the worst injury bulletin I've ever seen since I've been supporting Norwich. It's literally nine of our starting 11, you could say, are injured. And a lot of them are out long term. A Christoph Zimmerman, a Tim Close. That was arguably your starting centre-back pairing for a lot of last season. Both out. Probably won't see them again this season. Hernandez falls down the stairs. A lot of these things are out of our control and it feels so annoying that we've worked so hard to get here and we've played such good football and we started this season okay. And now luck has just gone against us. So, look, I really hope that it isn't as serious as I think it is in my head right now. But um, at the moment, I can't see past it. So I kind of just want to get through this Man City game without getting absolutely demolished. And then we'll see where we go from there. But not good news. Not good news. It might be worth noting if uh, you're one for patterns before match days. Every single time I've attended a park run, I think, before going to an Norwich game, we've won. Granted, most of them were... Northern games last season and one at Nottingham Forest last year, but I think I'm five out of five from park runs So if we're going off that we're gonna absolutely romp up today <laughs> There she goes Paula Radcliffe protege to the finish line. Woo! All right, Jen How was the run? Hot, very, very warm. Like, was it warm? It is warm, isn't it? Like wet on the floor. It was like a crisp winter morning mm. but hot. And One would say an Indian summer September. I got a PB from last week. Well done. Obviously, it's only our second time doing it. Of course. But now we're going for breakfast. It doesn't look like much. No, it doesn't, but it's good. It's lovely. It's the lady um, there saying. You're not going to the games. You're coming home. Well, you're coming back to Norfolk. I couldn't get a ticket. Oh. Is that the membership scheme? Oh, no. I've got a share a season ticket with my sister. Yeah. So, this so Rosie's taking it? No, my granddad's oh. taking it. I don't know. And who does he support? Luton. Oh, so Luton fans Luton in the home end. Play, oh, I know. God. I know, but uh, I'll be watching it on telly. Good that it's on Sky. Uh, probably just at home. There's not really any good pubs. Around With Jess from Bez. With Jess from Bez. He's been mugged of a ticket today. Oh. Disgusting. Big thanks to Phil from the club for sending the programmes through this season so we can get them before we go to the Carrow Road. Look how sick these front covers are. I've never used that word before. Sick. But that is cool. Retro. Very nice. Hello and welcome to the M11. We are driving back to the fine city of Norwich. And Jen, I've got a game for you. Okay. Let's play the game of 
drum roll. Which player has played for both Norwich City and Manchester City? Now, if you're playing along at home, please do pause the video now, put your answer, the first player that covers your head down in the comment section below. Until then, Jen, do you know which player I'm thinking of that has played for both Norwich City and Manchester City? In the current squad or ever? No, I'm thinking within the last two seasons. Uh, no. No? I don't know. Angus Gunn! Oh, okay, yeah. That was good. Fair. If you've got a correct answer, then tap yourself on the back. We're now going to drive to Norwich. How's the drive been so far? Good, very smooth. Yeah. We've not made any stops yet. No, we so haven't. So a bit hungry Do for you snacks. want to make a stop? Yeah. You got some popcorn? Yeah, I ate that all already. Some popper dumps. Yeah, uh, more snacks. Good. Onwards. Ready? Yes. Well, welcome back to the A11 this time. We've just gone past the full Wentways service station. And my question to you is, What's your favourite service oh. station? Now, we all know that Big Dave's is South Mims. Uh, what's yours, Jen? Gloucester. Gloucester. Wow, I wasn't expecting if that. If anyone has a chance to go to Gloucester service around. station. Get it on you. Go on. No, no, go on. No, flip it around. A little flip There we go. Oh, I'm, I'm still recording. Gloucester service station, on the drive home from Bristol the other day, yeah. it's like a farm shop, but not like... Wow. Not a greasy not, spoon. Not a, it's like a beautiful... Like food hall, oh, it's lovely. So, if you yeah. ever Bristol away, what other games are down there? Um, Bristol Rovers away, Bristol options, um, very nice. Good, Get back to you. Um, I am a fan of Thick Thorn. <laughs> That's already third. Third Service station. Service station. Um, no, I'm, I, I do like South Mims, I'm, I'm prone to a KFC in South Mims. Um, Oh, I can't even think of any off the top of my head. Anyway, what's your favourite? Let me know in the comments section below. The telly's in town. Chris Reeves in town. How you doing, mate? Yeah, Pretty little Woodfords. Woodfords. Little pint of wood. Oh, you are, you're a primary partner, are you, Christoph? How's things? The, uh, mate, what is better than a fire? the fire engine that serves beer? There is nothing better. And generally speaking, cold, crisp Woodfords. What have we got here? This is a little West Coast wary, isn't it? Yeah, this is a West Coast wary, boss. Um, so, yeah. yeah. Beautifully tested. And there's so many injuries, Chris. No, hang on. I was just going to say, there's so many injuries today. There is. You've brought your boots along. Are you thinking? I've literally, I've literally brought my boots. No, no, no. This is um, Max Aaron's signed boots for our competition. Who won? Um, who won? A guy called Webby. Webby? I'm meeting him in five minutes, any time. Is Webby up for Woodfords? Webby's all, Webby, Webby's Woodfords. Webby lives for Woodfords, I've heard. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy this pint whilst we can, Jack, because I think we're going to, uh... Yeah, and guess what? Demolished. You've been such a good friend for the past month. I bought you a little present. I'll give you that Have in you? a minute. In a minute. Was it? I'm not telling you just yet. Present? I'm not telling you just yet. Oh, top man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Really, we've got a fire truck. We've got Webby. How you doing, mate? Nice to meet you. Now, Webby, you are our competition winner for, well, we're doing about two a month at the moment, aren't we? <laughs> if more. Open that little box up. Look at them. Little Max Aaron signed boots. What are we going to do, do with them? Oh, it looks like Get out on the pitch. Today. Looks like I'm wearing them, <laughs> Get on there. Right back. right back, I'll have to play the day. Right back in the changing room. Oh. So more of the Timmy Pukey up front as well. Oh. In the well, I got the beard, but I ain't got the ass. <laughs> Webby, congratulations, Thank mate. Thank you very much. Nice little pair of boots for you. Good old Thank boy. You. Chris, I told you I'd get you a present. Do you want to know your present? Yeah, what's my present? It's only a golden gold ticket. Oh. Tuck into one of them. Thank Let me get you a coin much. and we'll scratch together. Yeah, of course, available from all program sellers. Just one pound. Have a little scratch, come on. Come on then, you confident? I'm so confident today. Yeah, no, I mean about the golden guard. I don't care about the match. No, I'm not. Yeah, we're not coming back. Here we go then. So, so five, 500 oh. pound prize. So pick the times, so you get two times. Right, and if so a goal is scored within... First half, I need them to score 22 20. minutes and two seconds. Yep. And then 51 minutes All right, for the cool. second half. Yep, lovely. Well, that's pretty doable. Lucky with Man number. City coming to down. Ooh. Oh, that's 1,749. That feels very lucky. Hang on a minute. There's another scratch. Yeah, here. have a little scratch. In it to win it. So oh. pound prize. Oh. So what does it say? No, you got match to match, you gotta match these, and then you can win that. You haven't matched. You oh. yeah. So keep that safe. I will. And you might be in it to win it. I will. I'm going to win. Golden goal. Get them now. Right. Little scratch, Rooney. Oh, then, Jack. Get 11 14. That's when Ash Deepman scores his first. 78.54, that's when Steepman rounds off the hat trick. Lucky number. 0 4 And finally, are we in it to win it? No, we're not. 
That could have been 20 pounds, but it's not. Anyway, we'll be back next week. Some more golden goal action. Oh, it's good to be back. Good following from Man City today. Good old, uh, good old long poke down from Manchester. So well done to them. Pat on the back. Good flag itch. Score prediction: six one City. Quick score prediction: seven nil Man City. Aguero hat trick. What could go wrong? Entertainment. Oh! Tricky feet! Oh! Unlucky. Go on. Go on. Oh! oh go on. Oh! <laughs> Unbelievable stackers. Go on, the Tampa time. Half time here. It's 2 1 City. Norwich City, that is. Christoph. The sun is shining, the doves are crying, and I'm feeling really, really great. What about that? What, what is going on? What is going on? I, I cannot believe, I'll, I will admit, I wrote us off, I think most people in the stadium wrote us off, the neutrals wrote us off, the pundits wrote us off, and you know what? I'm fed up of the disrespect of this football club. <laughs> I'm fed up of it. Because today we've shown why we're in this league, we've shown that we can compete against Liverpool, we've shown we can compete against Chelsea, and we've shown we can compete against Manchester City, who by the way, let's be realistic here, we're playing our resis. Mm. We're playing our resis against the best team in the well, league. we've got to, to give them a chance. 
honestly, you know, great finish from Toddy. Had to keep his composure. I know it was a sitter. Had to keep his composure. Kenny out of nowhere. What a sublime header. Sloppy goal to concede at the end, but you know what, Jack? You can't be greedy. I'm very, very happy that first half performance. Good. I'll happily lose. Still, honestly, genuinely, if we lose now, I'm still so bloody proud of it. No, I'm, I'm fed up with your disrespect. <laughs> <laughs> Tell the people what your bets were on today. Go on. I had 7 0 with Guerrero to score a hat trick. <laughs> Disrespectful. Anyway, here we go. Let's try and win this. We've got to win it. Keep it, keep it uh, up the pace with the, with the league leaders. I should have really go at the top of the table. Yes! 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 to Amadou, and Puki is on fire! Sam Byron, get him in the England setup. Get him in the England setup. Gareth, get on the phone, Gareth! He's your man, Sammy Byron. Let's go, fellas. Let's go, fellas. La, 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 la. Kenny McLean! Go on, Emmy. Oh, oh. Yes, boys. Yes. Four minutes gone, Norwich are still winning 3 1. I can't believe this is happening. You might not believe it, but you better believe it. It's happening, people. Oh, when the great score marching in on a million. 3 2, 88 minutes. Oh, they don't make it easy, do they? Come on, Rev! On your money, oh, young man! Come on, Benny! Never write us off! 
on, Daniel. Get in there. So, wow. Um, I'm genuinely a bit emotional after that. I've never, ever written a Norwich City side off as much as I did today. And I feel like I needed that result to just, you know, check me, check myself a bit. And remember that this Norwich City side is capable of absolutely anything. I don't think people will realise, if they're not a Norwich City fan, how big a win that is. Two seasons ago, we were 14th in the Championship. Now, we've just beaten one of Europe's, if not the world's best football teams, with an absolutely decimated side. Nine injured players that you could have picked from. That win, I will remember for the rest of my life. I'm so happy. I'm so, so happy that I got to experience that. And I hope you got to experience it with your friends, with your family, whoever it was. Because them days, well, for Norwich fans, them days do come around quite often. But they won't last forever. And I'm, oh, I'm so happy. What a performance. We've got, um, we've got a podcast coming out tomorrow. We'll, uh, we'll round it up and actually speak since then. But for now, go out, get a beer, enjoy it, take it in. And um, yeah, I love you all very much. See you later. Bye-bye.